What's happening guys, so called here, this is our first playthrough, first episode of Barn Finders. Here we go, somewhere in America, 1991. Largely similar to the real America, but not quite. Uncle Billy, wake up young and our generator is down. Get a battery from our truck and fix it. It's not a problem, we can do that. Right, here we go. I actually played the demo of this, um, but not for a while. I played it when it first came out, I think it took me maybe a few hours to get through it. But I've not played it since, so I can't imagine it'll be too much different, at least the first couple of, um, first couple of jobs, but we'll wait and see. Welcome to Barn Finders. Get car batteries, or get the car battery from the car's trunk, put it in the generator, and use your computer to find jobs and travel all over America. That sounds fine, I think it's pretty much the exact same as what the demo was saying, to be honest. Let's get rid of some of these. Get that out of our way. We can actually buy an axe and destroy these for, for parts later on, but we don't have, we've got nine dollars, so we're not going to get much with that. There's the car battery, there's the generator, is it over here? Oh there it is there. There we go. New mail. We don't have anything at all to, to sell, so we're just going to have to jump to the first job. So, let's jump to it. Email. Mick Cornholler. A naughty stag for a friend. Hello barn finders, can you help an old friend? So I heard there's still a naughty stag at the old red barn. Maybe you could find it, there's money in it. If you do, thanks. So we can get $300. Yeah, I think this is the same as, uh, as the demo. Let's travel. Oh, we can't travel there. We need fuel. I think there's fuel. Let me just... Oh, that's not what I meant to do. I tried to pick up that that tin there. There we go. I can. I think is this. I think this is a garage. I don't know what this is. Though. What's this? A floor skin. We'll take that. We'll take that. Yeah. See, all of these items here can give us um, materials to fix up damaged items. Up in the top right corner there, you can see the gear, the the wood and the rope. That is, that's that's what these items give us. But we can't do that just now, so let's grab this. This is a a Yamaha back wheel. So this is a this is an assembly part, if I mind right. So we can't sell this on its own. But what we can do is on the left hand side it says press T to mark for transport. So we'll press that and then that'll go into our storage. And I think when we upgrade this, this is a build assembly station, so we gather all the different bike parts, put it on here, put it together, and then we can put it here to sell it. So we need to keep an eye out for them. So that noise there. If I mind right, is a collectible golden paper. There it's there. We just need to find a way up there. How do we get up there? You need to actually form your own way up to collect them, I've noticed. Or I noticed in the demo anyway, because it's it's not very easy to get to. I don't think we can get away up here. No, we're not getting up there. Can we maybe jump on the car and jump up there? No, that's not going to work either. Um, this looks pretty low. What if we do this? Put that there. Put this up. That's not what I wanted to do. Put that there. There we go. Just like that. Take it. Right. 
It should be us. We should be good to go to our first job here. Email. No, it's not email. We've been to that. Is it Barn Hub? There we go. Travel. There we go. I think this the first couple of barns um, is just going to be basically what the demo was. Um, there could well be some more parts. I, I don't actually know, to be honest. But um, I can't see it being too different, if I'm honest. But we'll soon see. The Red Barn, Dwayne's Love Nest. Now, because I played the demo, I'm familiar with this mission, or this barn. Exploring abandoned barns. As a barn finder, your job is to find requested items, look for other valuable items, you can sell them in your shop, and search for additional items and secrets. Maps are full of them. That's fine. So, that golden paper that we collected um, just a minute ago, there's one up here. So, much like the last time, we have to make these or take these over there to, to form some kind of steps to get up there. So, let's give that a go. Put that closer. Oh, what's this? It's one of the wall skins. Don't think they were in the demo. I don't think they were, unless I just missed them, but. I I don't think I would have missed them, to be fair. Not when they stick out like that. So... I just spotted this out the corner of my eye there. Mark for transport. That'll give us 25 if we put it for sale. So let's get that picked up. Press T there. Let's put this... Don't know how that's going to hold up, to be fair. Let's rotate this a bit. Oh! Oh! That's not what I meant to do. Right, we finally made it up. That took much longer than it should have took. Every time I tried to climb it, the, the bits just kept falling. This is eventually what we ended up with. Yeah, that wasn't a... Uh, wasn't my best performance, I'll be honest. Right. Let's see what else is in here. Let's get rid of this, get rid of this. Once we get the axe, we will be coming back here. Because um, like I say, all of these loose items here are all potentially worth um, materials. So we will be coming back here. Let's just, can we sell this? No, can't sell that. Let's just have a quick look around. I don't think there's anything else out here, but... We'll have a little look because they might have added in some extra things. Look at that over there in the distance. Yeah, I remember this about this game. There was a, a strange twist in this game. There was aliens. Uh, I don't actually know too much about it. They kept it a bit discreet. Not discreet, obviously, there's a dancing alien there, but they didn't give too much away as, in terms of where the story's going with um, So it'll be interesting to know that. I think actually they left a drink in the demo for you. I think they left it down here. I'm sure they did. Unless they didn't. Oh no, there it's here. Yeah, this is the same as the demo. Delirium Theater. Moonshine. Boom. What's that poster added to the collection? I'll take it. I'll take it. There's another one of the tiles. Floor skin. Fine, I'll take it. I think there was something back here, actually. Yep. The High Five Wolf. We'll take this. T for transport. That should give us at least 75. 
when we put it into the shop, that's fine. Right, let's actually head in here and see what we can get. Let's sell all of this stuff. So, sell. Sell that. Get out of the way. Dump. Sell the mattress. This is new. Mr. Gustav. Medium item assembly. So this will be much like the motorbike in that it's it's not a finished piece, you need to put it together before you can sell it. That's fine, we'll take that. We'll take it. There's a key, it'll probably come in handy for something. Poster added. You need to be on the lookout for these the rags quite easy to miss to be honest but they can sometimes be hiding things like the poster that we just seen there for example let's get this out of the way throw that there and spin this around there we go and here's another fuel that'll do us nicely some whatever they are books DVDs, whatever they may be. There's a telly there. It's not a Sony, it's a pony. So there we go, 70. We'll take that. There we go, we'll take that as well, 30. We need everything we can get at this stage. There's nothing up there. Nothing there. There we go. Sunny cat. It wasn't letting us pick it up there. I think it's because it's in the shelf. Well, it was letting us pick it up, but it just kept putting it straight back down. Yeah, there's. Look at all the materials here. A lot of materials here. There's a part of the bike. There's a book there. I've just seen that no more. We can get a torch as well. I don't think it's going to be our first purchase though, in all honesty. Because there are more important things that we will use, for example, the axe. But depending on how the first couple of barns go, we might be able to buy buy everything. So we'll, we'll see how it goes. Oh, I remember this. The blow-up doll. Surely love. Uh, yeah, let's just get that. It's a bit disgusting, to be honest. Just lying there. I have to say, if I was a barn finder and I seen that lying on a dirty mattress, I wouldn't be touching it. I certainly wouldn't be selling it to anybody, that's for sure, but each to their own. And this is the stag that we actually came here for. 300. Instantly. We don't actually put this up for sale in the shop. We can just ship this away, if I remember correctly, so we'll pick that up. See where that takes us in terms of items left. Done. All items collected. So, in fact, I'll move this. Show you this as well. I've seen this in the demo. There's a plank in between these handles to keep the door locked. But they're sliding doors. So, if you could figure that one out, then please let me know. Go. Let's go back, travel home, leave the map and go back to the pawn shop, yes. Bobby Gray, interesting, the human specimen shows great potential. I will spawn random earth objects, continuing the experiment. So, could barn finders be the ones to save us? I highly doubt it. When we come back to the barns with the axe, we can collect items that he's dropped off. They're not like the, the main items that will give us a lot of money, but there's some items there that will probably give us a little bit more. Um, so 
and it's worth definitely coming back to them. But we'll need to come back anyway, like I say, with Axe. But we've done well there 10 out of 10, 181, 1 out of 1, 6 out of 6. So it's not bad. Not bad for the first one. Right, back at the barn. Let's see here. How to run your pawn shop. Unload the truck by pressing the button on the storage station. Use secondary action button to place items on the shelves automatically. I didn't actually know that. Open the shop during the day to start selling items to the clients. So, if we go up to the the shelves, we can press right click and that will put the things on the shelf automatically. That's actually quite handy to know, to be honest. So, all that stuff in there, we press this button. Uncle Billy will take it to the storage station. And if we click here, we can find it here. So, that's decent to be honest. This we can get rid of straight away, that's what the stars are for. These, like I've briefly touched on, these are puzzle pieces, so it's part of a bigger item that we need to we need to build. Although I didn't know about the frog, to be honest. I didn't actually know that was in the game, but that's fine. So, that'll be part of that. And this here, that's on these two items, that means that these are dirty. So we need to get them cleaned up. But we don't have that workstation yet. I think that's it here actually, the workstation. So let's just see if this works. Get rid of this trash. Yep. So that's fine. Do we have anything for here? Anything for there? No. Anything for here? Anything for here? This is the exact same as the demo, like I've said, guys. So if it looks like I know what I'm doing, it's because with this particular part, I, I sort of do. Like I say, I've not played it for a while. Um, but certainly once we get, not this next mission, but the one after it, I, um, I would be just as lost as anybody else that's never played it. So Welcome I'm definitely looking forward to it. So we have $115. We can't buy anything there, but we definitely need this axe and this shovel as well. See you later, partner. So I don't think we can do anything just now. I think what we need to do is we need to go and sleep, so let's go and do that. Can we just chuck this just now? Get away. Yeah, let's go in here. Tuesday, 7 o'clock. I think what I might do... I was actually planning on... just getting rid of these and selling them just now. But to be honest, I think what I'm going to do instead is I'm just going to head straight to the next mission. And then try and get as many items as we can to, to sell everything at, towards the end of this end of this um, part one I think that's what I'm going to do if we can even do that yeah, pack and send, let's get rid of that we should have done that actually before we went to, to sleep there's a new one, Uncle Billy bid event at bridge storage a new tournament, uh, blah blah blah. Let's go to the bridge storage and win this. The final round will give us tickets to Hawaii. If you find a car engineer, send it to Cousin Kevin. Accept the job. Barn hub, let's go here. Let's see, we have one, but we need two, so we could buy one for 50, and we've already got 415, so let's just go ahead and do that. And let's travel there. We'll put everything on the shelf and we, we'll come back for this one. We'll get it all sold, and then as of episode two, it'll be a fresh start. Here we go. Bridge storage, Miko special event. Tutorial, your first auction. Your goal is to be the highest bidder at the auction, that's self-explanatory. Use small and big bid buttons to increase the price. After winning, feel free to explore and take all the items. That's fair enough. Oh, 
Oh, oh, oh, what's happening, Sebastian? He was in the demo as well. He's, if I remember right, he was actually pretty easy to sell to. So, hopefully that's still the same. I'm gonna do this. Just quickly run around the outskirts, get rid of any of the little things that we can get rid of just now. Get rid of this. Do you know, it maybe would have been a good idea to maybe sell some things to get the axe, at least so we had something to come here with, but we need to come back anyway, so it's, it's no big deal, to be honest. Yeah, that noise there. There's a toilet roll back there, or a, a golden paper. So, if we've got the axe, we could just knock this through, then we've got it. But we don't have the axe, so... Yeah, that's fine. Let's get this auction started. Start auction. Do you want to start the auction? Yes, I do. So nobody's got it at 100, I'll wait till somebody else puts a bid in, there we go, Dark Samantha, Sebastian, Lady Dragon, we've not even put enough for anyone, there we go, 250. Let's go. Five two five. There we go. One in bed, five two five. That'll do me, that's fine. I'm just gonna do this for a start. See, there's an the engine for that bike, I think. So let's take that, the Jamaha engine. Unsellable in its current state, it needs to be assembled. Let's get that transported away. Collectible. There we go, get that as well. There's a fuse, we'll need that in a second. There's another tile, I suppose. I suppose that's what it looks like. Get rid. Get rid. Get rid. There's nothing in here. I'll leave these open so that I know I've been here. Is there anything under here? Nope. Nothing in there. Did I not just sell that? I thought I did. Unless I never, I don't know. Maybe I didn't. This is what the fuse is for. You put it in there, pull the switch, and it opens this door. Right, so... 150, see. You put that up, get that sold. Here we go, 55. There's two of them here. We get both of them picked up. We'll get this picked up. We'll get that out of the way. There's another tile. Or upgrade. Trash. We'll take that. There's nothing behind here, is there? I don't think so. Nope. Joe's of Joe Quest 4x4 collectible. Press T to mark the transport. But it'll take 150 off us. How much have we got? 501. That's fine. I'll take that all day long. 1200 is what it's worth. I'll take that all day. Get rid of that. 24, we'll take that. 48, we'll take that, definitely. 80. Yeah, we're starting to get into the bigger items now. Nothing in any of them. A 
hundred and sixty. Definitely. Let's see if there's anything back here. I don't think so. Oh, no, there is. There's a wheel. I'll just transport that out of the way. Oh, nearly missed that. There's some fuel. There's so much stuff here that we can destroy for parts. So much stuff. There's another frog. Comic page. Oh, dear, let's take this. Take this. On oh, there's the engine. Take that. That should be all the items. item to go. I don't know where that would be. Unless it's talking about that, because it's not away yet. I wouldn't have thought so. Maybe on one of these shelves. I don't know where that is. Let's have a look up here. Buy this. Dear customer, no this is exactly returns. what we need. There we go. Get rid of this. I don't know where that last item is, unless it's uh, the golden paper that it's talking about. Gears. Take that. It didn't give us anything. That's not what I was talking about. I wonder what I've missed. Here it is, guys. There's the last object. I had to go and destroy everything here, and this was literally the last corner that I was destroying. There was a shelf there, and here it was sitting away in the corner. So that's fine, so we'll take that and that should hopefully be all the items. Hopefully, there we go, all items collected. Right, so we can now head back to the, the shop. Here we go, collectibles. We've only got four out of five. So I don't know what we've missed, we maybe have to revisit that. But we've got everything else, 16, 16, one, one, one for one, one for one. So we're only missing one collectible. That's fine, we'll go back. Same as before, press the button, he'll put that in there. There we go, so we can just jump in here. We can start putting stuff on the shelf. Let's put stuff here. Nothing can go here. Yep, happy with that. Let me just go in here and see what else we have got. I think we might have all the parts for the bike. We've got the we've got the body, we've got the wheels. Did we not pick up the engine? There it is, yeah, we did. We did. Let me just go and For now, get this, destroy that, put that away, pick this back up. Oh, that must have came off the the barrier there. Right here, we'll pick this one up. 
the only reason I'm doing this is because I know that this is where it needs to go, so it just saves us running backwards and forwards when we get this workstation up and running because this is the build assembly station, so. There we go. So that's certainly ready for when this gets built, which is fine. Right, let's go ahead and sleep and in the morning we will open up the shop. Right, here we go guys, ready to open it. Press left to open close your shop. So, selling to the clients. Click on the client to start selling. You can sell, decline or haggle for the better price, which of course is what we are going to be doing. And when you haggle, when having a capital W and H, don't be too greedy or you might lose some money. Well, I don't think that's going to be the case because if somebody doesn't offer us what we want, we can decline. So I don't think we'll necessarily lose out on money. It might take us a bit longer to sell something, but lose out on money, I don't think so. And there we go, somebody's already in. Oh, two people are in. But what I'm going to do, nobody's in to see the car. So, what's happening? How are you doing? Let's haggle him. He's given us an extra seven. Boom. An extra 18. That's what I'm talking about. Try and get more. An extra seven. Well, 70, he's given us 102. I'll take that. Look at him, thinking he's getting a good deal. Sebastian, how you doing? 165. Let's haggle you a bit. An extra 38. Take that. Do you know what? I'll take it. I'll take it. In the top left corner, there's that bar that's decreasing. Um, just underneath the come in, we're open sign. That basically tells you when the next customer is going to be in. So when that goes to zero, you'll hear the bell. And there we go. Oh, he's back for something else, but I need to see if there's anybody at the car, and there's not. The same two people. Right, let's haggle you. Hi, There we go. You just need to take your time with some of them. Haggle them again. I'll take it. I don't think we're going to get any more out of them for that, to be honest. So let's put something else here. Let's put something else here, but we can't. Nothing else here. He's wanting this book. Haggle. Wasn't my best one. Do you know what? I'll take it. It's just a book. Let's put some more stuff up on the shelf. Oh, what's happening? What's happening? Nope, still nobody at the car. Hiya. That's a fair price, 53 for something that's priced at 48, but let's still haggle. <sighs> Could have done better there. Could have done better there as well, an extra four. Do you know what? We'll take it. We'll take it. some of this in the meantime. There we go, somebody's at the car. Let's see what we get for this. That's a good starting offer to be fair. Could have done an extra 300. That was poor. That was poor. Do you know what? Let's, let's sell it. 1700. 2293, I'll take that all day long. 
Right, and then let's go right, for right, you. Right. These are actually quite good starting offers, let's be fair. That's what I'm talking about, an extra eight. So 98 for something that's priced at 75, absolutely. Take it, it's yours. Get it out of the shop. Nothing else to go here. Nope. Nope. Miko! It should work! Miko! I'm going to buy this work. and this because we won't need them. No returns. Here we go. What are you wanting? You're wanting the tyre. That was poor again. I need to pay attention. I need to pay attention. Still wasn't the best. Let's just sell it. I feel tough. Oh, she's going to be tough. She's actually offered us what we've put it on for, so let's see. That's fair. I don't know how the first one can be more difficult than the second one. Do you know what? Let's sell that. I'm happy with that. Away. That's a that not a good approach to the customers. Oh, boom. There we go. We only had one shot of that as well because we don't have any more haggles left with him. Do you know what? An extra two. That's fine. Yeah. Get it away. Now, I need to... Where is our shovel? Let me just see. There was a dig spot over here in the demo and it's still there. This should give us another item to sell in the shop and it's a guitar, I think that's actually the exact same as what was in the demo so we could even put that up there we go Lady Dragon, what can I do for you? Okay, I need to pay more attention to these, I should be getting better I know it was in the green but oh well, I'll take it that's your final offer, that's fine that's fine. You can take it. There's a duck spot here as well. Oh, it's a tennis racket. I think... Yeah, I think these are the exact same. As in the demo. Here we go, he's one the guitar, there we go. Oh, well, this is easy. Well, spoke too soon. Mm, one more haggle, I think. There we go. We'll take it. We'll take it. $175 for something that we... Dug up outside, I'll take that. Take it up. Oh, didn't even see you there. What's happening? Too late. Too early. Right, there you go. I'll make you think you're getting a good deal. Here you go. Take it. Before I change my mind. We don't really have much more to sell apart from the things that's in here that um Oh, we can still sell this. We're sitting on that. I think what was it we were getting for that? About four hundred. Customise your pawn shop. With upgrade gun you can customise your pawn shop, use it to customise shelves, walls, floors and posters. Build stations to clean, repair, and assemble items. That's fine. But we're still sitting on this. So let's go to emails. This. 
parking sand. Can't believe it was sun on that. <laughs> there we go. That was a good one. Final offer, that's fine. That's fine. You can take it. Who's this? Bam bam. Bada bada bada. Papa. That's what I'm talking about. Three. I'm not too bothered about these smaller items, if I'm honest. <laughs> you can take it. Read your PC, computer, email. There we go. I've only got one more item to get sold. So, I don't even think I'm going to haggle, if I'm honest. Don't even think I'm going to haggle. Here you go. Delilah. Do you know what? I have it. It's yours. You're welcome. Happy birthday. So, if we... What I do want to do is... Where's the, the gun? I want to upgrade this station. Miko's cleaning station allows you to clean dirty items. Dirty items have the dirt icon. Put items on the cleaning station and clean it with the secondary action button. That's fine. Fair enough. And we want this one as well. You have to clean up from overlapping parts. That's fine. Let's just... Who's in the shop? There's actually nothing there. Or is there? Oh, of course there is. There's a tennis racket. No, you're not getting that for 80. Twenty. I'll take it. There you go. Take it and get out. Let's see if that's done anything for us. Nope, still overlapping. What about that now? Nope. There we go. So, combine items to create new ones. Look for puzzle icons, you will need them. Press middle station. Press middle station's middle button to assemble that item. So, let's get rid of that. So, there's that. That just automatically throws itself in there. There we go. Middle button. Transfer form from storage station or drop items by hand. I don't know where this can be sold though. Let's see these. I don't know what that does. Nothing. Nothing. So how do I sell it? I've got no idea. Do you know what? Let's get this repair station as well. We may as well. How much does this cost? 800. Do you know what though? It's worth it. Miko's repair station allows you to repair broken items. Broken items have the hammer icon. Fix damaged spots using resources from smashing junk in with well, smashing junk with the axe, which is exactly what I says um, at the very beginning. But guys, to be honest, I think that's as good a place as any to leave this episode. And the next one will fix the broken items, clean the the dirty items, put them up for for selling. But I think before we do anything, we'll head over to the next mission. But that'll be for the next one, guys. Thanks very much for watching, and I hope you've enjoyed.